Thank you. Welcome one and all. Uh, it's so thrilled to have a live performance in front of a live audience. Uh, it, we did have this experience in the spring, albeit on a smaller scale, and I'm just so thrilled to see so many people here this evening. So thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, my name is Dr. Nolan Howda, and I conduct the concert band here. For the last two years, I was conductor of the jazz band as well as the pep band. Uh, these students and I are very excited to be performing and sharing our musical efforts with you. I wrote program notes for each selection we will play, but I wanted to speak a little bit more about the next work on the program. Uh, words not written in the, the program. The composer of our next selection is a sophomore music major here at the University of Dubuque, Riley Sint, class of 2024. He originally hails from Eldridge, Iowa. Riley will be playing pipe organ with the concert band during the world premiere of The Peace Within. The composer, Riley, writes the following. Throughout one's life, it is only natural that they experience grief in some way, shape, or form. Perhaps it is just a rough day, a bad experience, or even a devastating loss. Each and every one of us has a unique way of responding to such sadness and grief in our lives. Some of us write, some of us may enjoy a recreational activity, perhaps we surround ourselves with friends and family, or perhaps people go to church to reflect silently. No matter how devastating our grief may be, we all have unique ways of handling it. I personally chose music as my coping method. Blow is the inspiration behind the peace within. On February 14, 2018, I experienced what has been the hardest loss of my life when I lost my best friend to a car crash. He was on his way to church to help me with music at church for an evening service. His death was announced at the start of the service. I could hardly read the music through my own tears. As I sat there stunned, I began to recall all of my memories with my friend, and my mind began to wrap itself around the fact that he was gone and not coming back. Reality had sunk in and had hit me harder than a brick. Fast forward three years, and I was seated at the bench of the University of Dubuque's newly installed Opus 97 pipe organ. The third anniversary of my friend's passing had just come and gone, and while taking a break from practicing, I happened to come across a Facebook tribute to him, which hit me harder than I had prepared myself for. As I would normally do when feeling down, I began to play. As I sat down at the bench, I chose the string sounds with a soft solo sound for a melody. As I continued to play, more and more thoughts filled my mind, and my pain slowly went away. Each keystroke felt like another painful weight from my soul was lifted and carried out. I was left with a feeling far greater than anything other feelings I had experienced. I felt content and at ease. I had found my inner peace. This song is all about finding our inner peace amidst a tragedy. Although it may seem hard or even impossible, it is there within each and every one of us, and we mustn't forget that. No matter how devastating and life-altering our grief may be, we will find inner peace. This song is dedicated to the family and friends of S.J. Madden Jr. I have not forgotten you, and I am at peace knowing you are in heaven. May God keep you until we meet again.
Thank you. Last year, I had the good fortune of conducting a world premiere with the UD Jazz Band. This was an important uh, opportunity for the students, for our institution, and to living composers who continue to create music each and every day. Uh, I'm pleased that you were able to join us for this world premiere performance of The Peace Within, uh, and I hope you'll be in attendance at our other band concerts. Every concert this academic year will feature a world premiere. We also have uh, two more student composers whose music is going to be featured, and we even have a faculty soloist lined up. It's going to be an exciting season. We have a lot of great music and great uh, exciting things happening in the University of Dubuque bands. Uh, all of the concert band pieces this evening, maybe you've already noticed in the program, uh, are either written by a living composer, have been arranged by a living arranger, or in the case of the last piece, both living composer and living arranger. So this, this includes our next selection, Irish by John Paulson.
Thank you. After the concert band's final selection, there will be a brief pause, not a true intermission. A brief pause as we tra transition to jazz band. This should take only a few moments. We're not even going to clear the stage. Uh, be, so be sure to remain for the jazz band portion of the concert. You will be sure to enjoy it. Concert band's final selection, Suite from Symphony Fantastique, uh, is a wonderful work. The original orchestra version uh, helped usher in the Romantic era and helped expand the possibilities of programmatic music, music which tells a story. So you'll see some um, some Cliff Notes version of the of the story uh, in your in your program. So come along with us as we travel to a ball, an execution, and a witch's Sabbath. I guess we're a week or so early, so happy Halloween. Enjoy Sweet from Symphony Fantastique.
Oh, great. It's on. Awesome. First try. Hello, everyone. My name is Dr. Evan Glickman. Uh, I'm the director of the Jazz Band, which is the second ensemble you guys will be listening to tonight. So thank you so much for coming. Uh, let's get another round of applause for the concert band. <laughs> I, uh, I had the pleasure of rehearsing with them throughout the semester, and it was really a joy to make music again after two years of really very little of that. Um, so that was great. Uh, so this is my first semester here, and um, I'm really excited to share all the work that the jazz band has also been doing all semester. So we have four tunes that we're going to play for you that are going to kind of take you through um, some of the different major periods of the jazz era, starting in the 1920s. Um, everyone's looking pretty good? Yeah. So these students have worked really hard, really excited to share that with you guys. Um, and for this one, um, for this part of the concert rather, please feel free to, when a soloist is playing, once they're done, right, make some noise, clap. It's a little bit different than concert band style. I'm really trying to encourage that atmosphere of, uh, you know, celebration and enjoyment. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys really enjoy this and we are going to have a great time. Might just be one or two more minutes, but thank you for your patience. And I see the concert band students coming in now. Very nice. And uh, yeah, we'll get to it. Thank you so much for coming.
It is great, wonderful. Uh, thank you so much. Those are our first three tunes. So we covered a pretty wide range of jazz history, right? Um, Freddie Freeloader, which is a classic Miles Davis tune from the cool jazz era. Um, Harlem Nocturne, which goes way back to that 1920s kind of black and white Humphrey Bogart solving mysteries kind of feel, right? And then the last one we just played was called The Girl from Ipanema, which really was the first Bossa Nova tune that kind of broke into the charts in the United States in the 1950s. And that one is really a great joy to play. And students sound great, don't they? It's just really great. We're, having, sorry, we're having a lot of fun playing for you guys. So we have one more tune. It's a classic Charlie Parker tune, and it's a little bit more upbeat. It's supposed to be a lot of fun, and we'll kind of end with, a, with that party feel for your Friday night. Thanks for coming. Soloists, very nice playing. 
Excellent playing. We have some very, very great soloists here. Back on vibraphone, awesome. Saxophones, trumpet. And now one more round of applause for the whole group. Thank you. We had a lovely time playing for you, and I hope that you guys enjoyed listening to us. And please have a safe drive home, and thank you for coming to our concert. Concert band and jazz band, we both very much appreciate all of you coming. Thank you.